right, good morning, everybody. Uh, man, I can't believe how fast the channel's growing. We're up to 12,500 subscribers, and uh, man, it's so awesome. Thank you, guys. It's pretty cool. Um, I've been putting a couple short videos out there of the, the flower patterns that we cut in freehanded, and everybody's been digging them, so uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, today, we are doing a parking lot, some sections of a parking lot at a bank. We got... Um, Nicole bids all these jobs, my wife, and sometimes I don't even get to see the job until I get there. And in this case, that's the deal. So, um, taking out the front sidewalks and the walkway, and then there's a couple strips of uh, like permeable concrete that needs to come out. So we're going to rip that stuff out and replace it with just regular concrete. So, first thing this morning... We're going to run to uh, see our buddies at New Way and grab us our breaker. And then um, we got the haul truck that's going to be there early. So um, see what we can get done today. Yesterday was Owen's graduation. And uh, it was funny. Jason sent me a picture last night of Owen. He was sitting in there with all the kids, 400 kids in his graduating class. And old dude was passed out, had his neck bent over backwards on the chair. He was snoozing. So, uh, man, we're proud of you, Owen. That's awesome. Good job graduating high school and good job pouring concrete the same day you graduated, man. That's, that's pretty badass. So, um, um, I'll see everybody at the shop. I'm almost there. Um, so I'll see you soon. Morning. 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 What the fuck are you smiling for? <laughs> about to get physical boy yeah. oh shit jt morning, morning, you work out already this morning come from uh, yeah, the gym waiting for everyone to get here so we can do it as a team yeah. you know? owen good job graduating buddy that was a pretty yeah. cool nap you took Thanks. last night dude yeah it was dude <laughs> <laughs> she, she, she said you gotta sit up straight Say, bitch, I poured concrete today. I almost did. I know, Dave. Well, you should be on Facebook. I posted it hours ago. I saw it yesterday. Yeah, well, JT's really well, got back into the... The bank will get a lot of hits today. Yeah, yeah. Well, Jazzercise is coming back. Yeah, I mean, I'll just be out there just tearing out this concrete. You know? <laughs> It's a whole onesie and everything. Okay, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, boy! <laughs> oh, JT. JT's fired. <laughs> oh, God. I, I got to say, that's the first time a dude's ever pulled his clothes off and had a onesie on in front of me. Hey, never had a I'm here for whatever you need, baby. You know right. what I'm saying? That's what you put on your application, That's dude. Right. That's why we That's signed right. it on the spot. You know, JT is just everything. Yep. Jack of all trades, you know? The only thing he put on his application was $20 is $20. Yep. <laughs> I'm a slut. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a slut. <laughs> uh, all right. Um, so we're, we're running behind this morning. I was supposed to start earlier, but I was editing videos and I forgot all about the actual work, work. yeah so now Dave has to we got to get the green truck out so we'll move everything again and I think we're going to end up taking this thing first and then I'll probably come back and get the excavator too because we got to tear out sidewalks and a front approach okay. and the parking lot strips okay. so we going to the one first? no we're going to the Butler Hill one off in South County all right, everybody, we got Dave in the green truck. He's headed the new way. Ricky's gonna meet us at the job. JT is trying to figure out if he's gonna work today or if he's gonna go and start up his own jazzercise class thing. I'll do that this afternoon. Oh, you already got that That's going afternoon. on. Oh, okay, afternoon classes. I'll be sure to not it's sign too up. Hot. I didn't want to sweat in it, so I took my outfit off. Thank you. All righty, we're here. See what we got going on. Yeah, he shut it off this time. 
<laughs> this will be the first day <laughs> I've ever had a haul truck pull up on the job and just sit there. But it's all my fault. I'm addicted to YouTube. That's teamwork there, Jason. Yes, sir. I can't believe JT pulled out a freaking onesie this morning. Oh, that was hilarious. Dude, he, he, ready for he's too, too much. <laughs> All right, I'm about to jump in this breaker and start popping this stuff out. Let the fun begin. Start it up and set it down real quick. Why don't you take two wrenches? Um, look in my toolbox. I got a crescent wrench. I got some wrenches in my truck and in my trailer. I'm gonna set it down real quick. Man, I have horrible luck with these things. This is a brand new fitting that they just made today. Looks a little loose. Every time I use a breaker, it seems like I got hydraulic oil spraying out. We need to get our shit to clean that window again too. Their new hose already broke, Dave. Yeah, look, I got, look at the side of the machine. There's hydraulic oil everywhere. It, they, well, they didn't have it tight, so it just sprayed the shit everywhere. Did you make that hose? No. Nothing <laughs> <laughs> ripped, right? We just got to wrench it? Or what yeah, we, we just got to tighten it up. It's leaking somewhere right here. Somewhere in all this stuff. It was leaking out right here. We need some crescent wrenches. How's your reservoir? Well, I mean, it didn't lose that much. Oh, okay, good. A little bit. Yeah, yep. it's on there. Yeah, of course, it's a crescent wrench. Sure, it couldn't. That should work. There you go, bud. I guess every time we get a breaker now, we'll just have to get our Windex and all of our stuff handy. Yeah. Hey, let me get a little spritzer of that. I got, oh, we got this stuff right here. I use window cleaner for my hands and hand sanitizer for my window. What? Who dusted the asphalt with the breaker? Oh, that wasn't me. No. That was Owen. That was Owen. Is he on his way back yet? Yeah, boy, look at him way. making tracks, yeah. boy. You see the smoke flying off this fucking Shoot. Look at him now. He's, he's holding your tea on his forehead because he's hot. <laughs> Why does it look like he's going down steps? Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't taping. Did he just go down? Nope. What happened? Down. Why? Well, not on purpose. Oh. Hey, no sitting down on the job, Owen. What the hell did you do? I fell like a tree. Stumbled. 
Jeez, boy. Hey, man. This asshole was in my way. That's all I needed to know. And what we're getting ready to do here, so we're the circle stays, and we're doing five slabs here. The one the breaker's on, this one, this one, this one, and that one. Okay. Nothing's going back colored. The reason they're doing this is because of this trip edge. This curb is going to stay okay. all the way down. The curb's not coming out. Cool. So right here at this spot, what we're going to do is I'm going to take our little cup wheel, and I'm going to try to grind this off and yep. get that little edge out of there yep. and then our new concrete's gonna go down to this grade and to that grade all right so Are you gonna pour today? i don't think so i mean i would love i would love to but he said we're gonna do that when it comes he just is working out a little uh, bit and then no you're not done 10 more reps with the bigger one though <clears throat> yeah yeah you gotta put one in your tail. What are you talking about? Oh, your whole ass is hanging out. Why are these bangs? <laughs> 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 I pull them up, they're gonna go right back down. Owen, I need you to finish. Keep sweeping. Yes, keep sweeping and then finish your caution tape all the way down, just how he's got it. Drive your pins in, put a cap on it, pull your tape down, and do that in the whole thing. Uh, hurry up. Yeah, you'll have to start. Yeah. And yeah, and I told you, you got a time limit on all this stuff now. You got two hours to get that done. Hurry up. You got a shit, Dave? Yeah. Okay, well, you got to make a wish. You get shit in one hand and make a wish in the other and see which one fills up first. You wish you had to take a shit, huh? Go to the gas station, dude. What are you doing? You going to poop on yourself? You could have already been wiping by now, but you're standing here talking about it. I gotta run for it. It's gonna shake. It's gonna shake. Got a turtle head poking. <laughs> All right. Well, make sure you turn your camera off before you go in there. All right. Now we're moving on to tearing out the front of this place, and this stuff's just crumbling right out like crazy. And now this place is getting busy too. But everything's come out pretty good. That uh, weird concrete came out like asphalt. Really crumbly. We're making a mess on Tessons. Yeah. Uh huh. A mess on Tesson. Uh -huh, you like that? Oh, and whenever he's pulling that with that machine, don't mess with it. If that thing gets stuck in there, that bar will bend down and get you. See if you can. Grab that whole thing and put it in the truck. Just lean that up into the corner, buddy. I need you to go grab us a couple shovels and a couple come-alongs. Okay, babe, okay. I heard him saying, before I did all that, don't try to grab all that in my brain. I knew he didn't say that, but in my brain, I was here. No, no, don't try and grab all that, come on. You know how that's how it goes. That's like if we stay home. If it's supposed to rain and we stay home, it don't rain. Oh, the whole corner. Yeah. Just the tip. That's gonna suck. That thing's oh, loaded, dude. God. They should have put that front pallet on the back. Oh, we're gonna build a wall out of this. We're just gonna stack them up and let it rain. Wet it down. <laughs> all right, everybody, we got this thing all uh, tore out, hauled out of here. Me and JT just had to run up to the city to get some chairs for a party this weekend. So we're just gonna get a measurement on this deal. Here, go ahead and get a measurement on this and I'm gonna go measure this stuff up front. And uh, we got concrete coming at eight o'clock tomorrow. I still gotta put a little bit of rock in here and then tie some steel in this little thing. We got this little spot up here in the front. All ready to go. And uh, so we're gonna pour this out tomorrow morning and pour this out. And then I'm going to another bank that's just 
couple miles from here and we're gonna do the same thing on that one then when we get down there we're coming back here and this slab and this slab are going because these are some some trip hazards right here all the way around these spots was all heaved up you can see on that curb still i'm going to shave that down with a cup wheel to eliminate that little trip edge there so once we pour this out we'll come back and cut this section out across this spot and replace that so that's going to be it for today and um we'll see you guys in the morning morning what up I see that. You got some drinks ready to put in that deal? Yeah. Cool. You got those spritz and peppers in there. You ready to pour some Crete? Are we shoe pouring it out of the. Yeah. Yep. For both of them? Yep. So you know what that means. You're running the shoot. Gotta tell that driver what to do, when to stop, how fast to dump it out, how high that chute needs to be. Tell them to lock it, unlock it, pull up, pull your pants up, pull the steel up. You gotta be on it, dude. Tell everybody what to do. You ready for that? I'm the man in charge, other than you. I'm just joking, I gotta come along that I don't want laying on the ground, so I'm gonna need you to hold that thing up. That's probably good, buddy. Man, I go up to that place with the whole big old trailer and I'm like, man, I gotta get 50 chairs. She's like, well, you got a big enough trailer, don't you? <laughs> we can put them in the back of the truck. <laughs> what are you doing here, taking some of these sodas? Yep. It's actually, it's this job right here. Oh, okay. So I would say that we're gonna have to probably hit this border again with some darker sealer. I went through and did some little stones, but dude, this job's five years old. So I've already sealed it a couple times, you know, but we're gonna have to go back, hit this border with some stained sealer, you know, like colored sealer and then seal the whole thing. Man, now we're up to 13,500. I seen that this morning, this morning. I was like, damn boy. Yeah, and I can't believe it. It's growing so fast. It's slowed down now that, that one short, or that whatever they call it, that little short video, it started uh, to slow Petering down. Off, yeah. yeah, it's like 2.5 million. It, my buddy told me it popped up on his YouTube one day. Really? It popped up, he's like, oh dude. Showing the guy he works with, like that's my buddy who he works with and shit. That's cool. Yeah, I was like, damn, I was like, that's badass that it's popping up. Yeah. I wonder why it's got so many views, you know? Yeah, it's pretty awesome. So, were you uh, messing with that video last night yeah, a little bit? Yeah, I dude, I don't know why it's taken me so long. So sorry, everybody, it's taken two weeks to post a video, but I didn't expect uh, this thing to grow so fast and everybody's messaging me wondering when the next video is going to be out so i'm going to have to uh make some changes with my scheduling to uh you know i planned on spending a year to try to get a thousand subscribers right and you know i was ready and now it's done this and everybody's like dude where's the next video so right. i'm working on it guys and uh you know i'm gonna try it my best to get you guys uh like one video a week at least with a couple little videos in between uh but i've also talked to a buddy of mine about helping me out on editing some of these because i didn't realize how much work it was so but man we really appreciate everybody tuning in and checking it out we'll try to explain things a little more as we go uh you know each one of us is trying to get used to being in front of this camera and whatnot i never really liked doing it and never liked the sound of my voice and all that so now i'm finally used to that and uh 
Right. You know, yeah, oh, yeah. I'd start listening to it at yeah, first, and I'm like, dude. Of me, I'm like, dude, what is wrong? With you? Uh, you know, you sound so weird. I know. Like <laughs> I'm like, is this I what sound... I sound like to you? Right. It's like, man, I thought I sounded a little bit more manly than that. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so what our plan is, I haven't talked about any of the shirts or any of that stuff yet on any of the videos. So now what we're going to do is, you know, we're going to open up the little YouTube merchandise store. And we've got a ton of cool stuff. I mean, we've been doing shirts and hats and hoodies and sweatpants. And, you know, my wife makes all the... Was that a door? Dude, I think that was. That was a door laying in the <laughs> middle of the road. Uh, but anyways, you know, we got coffee cups. I don't think this is one. No, that's not. But we got the coffee cups, the, the Yeti tumblers, um, keychains. Yeah, be getting some new shirts. Magnets, yeah, all kinds soon. of little stuff. Yeah, the Red Friday shirts I think are going to be awesome. Now, here's the deal with the Red Friday shirts. We have a local company, or not company, we got a local uh, deal. It's called Camp Hope and it's basically for injured veterans and what they do is they just man they help them out you know they do things for them they get them in the houses they help them go they let them go fishing they take right, them hunting right. you know and we've donated to them over the years so what we're going to do now actually a really good friend of mine uh big john um uh, rest in peace big guy he was you know the dude that got me turned on to working with camp hope man he donated to them and spent so much time you know making stuff for auctions and whatnot so um especially in honor of john i definitely am going to get these red friday shirts going everybody's been asking about them what we're going to do is you know we're going to have some of the proceeds from them red friday shirts say five bucks a shirt something like that all going straight to camp hope right. Right, we're here and it is freaking chilly out it's like 50 degrees i didn't think it was going to be so cold nobody's got jason's got long sleeve on let me get that long sleeve shirt hey whose shirt is this Couldn't tell you. I don't have that. you don't have that that's Jason's. It's not made out of Turkish linen, but... Turkish, you, you only wear 10,000 thread count for Dave. Oh, I guess I'll just have to work and warm up that way. That thing's too small. Telling you what, one phone call away. Can't beat that, huh, David Limburger? Yeah, he got donuts, we got the cones, we got the octagon square hey, bottoms like you was talking about. You got sealer, you got... You got oh, I forgot the sealer, Dave. Son of a bitch. Do you need a sealer? Yeah, I do. <laughs> We're done. Dave, you remember what we just had this talk and I said, Dave, look, I'm going to start having you keep Order track of all this stuff. So he waits till you get here to ask for the sealer. This, we want to do QVC once a month. Yeah. Same word. Well, I mean, so I just run back and shop. Shop. back yeah. and forth. Stack it up yeah. in front of the shop door. Yeah. I think I'm just going to... I'll just park here. Anytime you need anything, just boom. Hey, Owen, grab my yeah. phone out of there. That, Hurry up. If I was you, yeah. yes. I would just wait here until we... Andy. I'm going to follow you around, baby. Dude, guess Good what? Girl. You're getting in a Red Friday selfie with us. We're not. But I don't have a red on. I don't care. You got a red on your hat. Yeah. And you got the red letters on your shirt. Do I? Right here, Owen. Hey. If we could get a new way to do the Red Friday, then we got some. That would be cool as hell, actually. Hey, come up a little closer, buddy. Come up a little closer. I thought I did. Look how that thing sits. A little bit more closer. Dave, come up here by Ricky so I can see how to take this picture. Yeah, I'm trying to take a damn picture. You guys are like a bunch of kids. Hey, 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 hey. Any second now, someone's going to drive in right here. Closer, further. What do we do? Yeah, come on now. Whoa. Everybody line up. I'm going to run over on the end. No, you're good. Scoot over a little bit. Everybody in. Everybody in. Come on, little buddy. Come on. Get in here, yeah. I think it's video and I don't know. I don't know what's going on. At least give a thumbs up or something. Do something like this. Come on, yeah. All right, just keep hold that pose. Keep going. We don't know what's I had it on 10 seconds. Let's see if it worked. Look, now it takes it right now. Yeah. Oh, we got it. Oh man, I got the fucking hold on, we gotta do it again because I got this in the way. That's the, the handle's right in the picture. That timing. 
That's him. Impeccable. Oh dear. Have a great one, guys. Yep, you too. It should be in his truck. And what? Okay, it's in his truck. What'd you say before the pull top? Need a knife. I got one right here. They sell them, Dave. You can. You know that? I was waiting for the red top to do. Oh, you want that cut coat, huh? Oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> Help, JT's stuck. Oh no! Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh -oh. JT can't get out. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> morning. Morning. Happy birthday. Keep him coming, keep him coming, keep him coming, keep going, keep going. That's it. Tall guy, not here. Yeah. <laughs> Oop. <laughs> I knew he was gonna do that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I wish you guys knew how good that was. You don't even have cream and sugar in there. Black coffee, just straight, no sugar, no cream. Ooh. <laughs> straight off the side. That's gross. I, I see him at the end of every day, he wrings the sweat out of his yep. socks right into there. Owen, oh, buddy, it's gonna be up to you to keep this steel pulled up. So don't get in our way and whatever you gotta do, just keep it lifted up. You gotta stick your hands in the concrete and get concrete on them, that's what you gotta do. Yep. And well, keep the edges all cleaned up. Yeah, little cuts that I have. Yeah, it'll seal them up. Yeah, yeah, that, that's what it'll do. Hands. So get in, hey, get Break on the other side of them and get ready to have that yep. going up. Yep. Yep. It's going to be non-stop until this truck is Yes, not, and when he ahead. means non-stop, he means we're going to be going full bore until we stop. Hoorah! Ooh, ooh. On your toes, fam! On your toes! On the hop! Okay, we did it. Your truck can hold a lot of concrete. <laughs> man, thanks, Andy. Put that sealer behind Ricky's truck. Thank you, man. I appreciate it, yes, dude. Yeah. It All right, I'll see you soon. Yep. Man, I'm glad that he's rattling. I thought he was going to be, uh, I thought we were going to have too much, way too much, but that rattle's all I needed to hear. Man, that was a long strip, Jason. Yeah, well, Wasn't it? Yeah. Shoot. I don't think I've ever met you before. I'm George. Rick Thomas. How you doing? Rick? Nice to meet you, sir. Uh, I don't need a ticket. Right. Yep. Man, if you're thirsty, there's a cooler inside that trailer. Help yourself. Thanks. Yes, sir. Have a good weekend. Dave says, brought to you by my nighttime medicine, Metamucil, and Depends. <laughs> and also Depends. On what I ate last night. If yes. I have to wear Depends. Manton, please. So he told all to get badges, so what's that? <laughs> Go to Walmart, you'll find it. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, so trying to make that, that's why that raid, we had to pin it in, because it's literally wood. I didn't know it was wood. Yeah, when did they start doing that? I've never seen anything like I've that I've never before. seen pull top with a wooden top before. It was always like a foam. Yeah, I've always, it's been foam. Huh. Like the shit we just pulled out of here. And then it's just got a little perforated. Yeah. It comes in a roll. Yeah, I've never seen that. Learned something new today. I learned that I don't like this shit. Yeah, well, 
I couldn't understand. I was well. No wonder it wouldn't work. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, that that's awesome. crazy. Can you see a broom pattern anywhere? Does it? You think it matters which way I pull this stuff? It's going this way. Everything's going this way besides the circle. Well, everybody, just about out of here today on this Friday. It's only 10 o'clock, it's 10 after 10. So as soon as we get this finished up here, Ricky and Dave are gonna go and seal a job, a little patio and Imperial. And then I gotta take the excavator back to the shop and drop it off and I'm gonna meet them guys at the job to see if we need to do any staining on this thing. We poured this one about five years ago, and uh, I haven't sealed it. I think it's been two years since I sealed it. So when we get over there today, we'll see how it's holding up and see what we need to do. Well, we've got to see Zoner go by all day long on this job. Their plant's right up the road. Uh, that's not Zoner there. So we got this thing all done today. No problems, everything went good. It's crazy this trench don't look like 15 yards, but it ate it up quick. So um, we gotta do a little brooming and clean up a little bit. Got us some new cones today. You know, we're just now kind of getting into doing, you know, this commercial type work. So always been a residential guy, but we've got a lot of people reaching out, re reaching out to us you know, for stuff like this, so can't pass it up. They just had some heating issues up here on this front. So we made sure we cut everything in nice and tight for them. This one curb here, this curb isn't attached to the sidewalk, but this little deal here, I'm gonna take my cup wheel and I'm just gonna grind that down for them to eliminate that trip edge. And, and we've got this pool top and I've never got pool top with wood tops on it. But we couldn't find, we couldn't get it to go around that radius for nothing. It was because of the freaking wood on there. They always had cork tops on them. So this stuff all turned out looking real good. When we come back next week, this slab right here and this slab is coming out. And then we got a saw cut across that sidewalk over there. So I'm gonna leave here and head over to Imperial meet up well, actually i'm going to take the machine back to the shop drop it off and then i'm going to shoot over to imperial and meet ricky and dave over there um this job i've already sealed it one or two times since i poured it it's about five years old so uh we're going to see what needs to happen i did some staining and stuff over there so um, i may do some color uh you know some a tented sealer on the border and then just seal the thing but i haven't seen what it looks like yet i know it still looks good but we'll see what happens um it's about a wrap on this one here so memorial weekend you uh owen he's owen you're working still this weekend aren't you yeah this kid graduated this week poured concrete all week long now he's going to work at daly's restaurant over the weekend and then you're going to be back on tuesday monday or no, we're off Monday. Yeah, Monday's Memorial Day. So. Man, I'll still get up and go sit out in the sun. Man, don't lie to me, Owen. No, this <laughs> motherfucker will make me. Actually, no, you can probably stay at Woodlands on Monday. No, 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 I'll be home Monday. I'll be so home so Sunday. you're coming home Monday, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be home Sunday. Oh. I feel like. 
You guys doing any fishing or anything down there? Yes, thank you for reminding me. I gotta get my license renewed. Yes. You know, you can do it on your phone now. You don't have to go to yeah, the thing. Yeah, you gotta get the app and all that stuff. I can do my hunting license and everything yeah. on there. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do that, yeah. yeah. Well, I guess I'm going with you. Spend a little bit of my graduation money. Ooh. Graduation. Going with you to get your hunting license? Fishing or your fishing license. license, I mean? What do you mean from farm to home? Fishing license, fishing pole. Are you I'm going? going? You're not going pole? fishing, though. Yeah, you ain't He's, that's well, nice. He's gonna buy them for you, Jason. Right. <laughs> yeah. I'll buy me and you each a fishing pole. Damn, that's cool. Yeah, I like red. Right, right. Yeah. I'm getting, a I'm getting a specific pole, a catfish pole. Oh, you want one like Grandma and Grandma? Yeah, I want one like that Grandma and Grandma. Ooh, See, I like to make fishing fun. I like using a little Snoopy pole for everything. Yeah. You get a freaking five pound bass on that little thing, yeah, it's shoot, it's like, what? Right. <laughs> See, that's why I don't, I don't want mine to, my first ever fishing rod that I buy to break. Oh, it's gonna break. It's gonna break. It's, gonna break yeah. it it's inevitable. It's gonna break. I eventually. mean, man, I'll be honest with you. I'm not a, I mean, I'm not a huge fisherman guy, so I'm cool with going to Walmart and just grabbing a couple old school Zebcos. Yep. Zebco 33. Yep. There's nothing wrong the with the push a button. Zebco nope. 33. That's it. There's been a million fish caught on a Zebco 33 class. Yeah. Million. Just in this circle. Yeah. Right. Hey, there you go. <laughs> right. There you go. I think I've still Thanks, got buddy. two of them at the house. Oh, so many left. Uh, sure. Where do you want your monster? All right. Let's get out of here.